Welcome to the tutorial on SVG Motion Path Animation with Cyrus. Today, we'll explore how to create and animate motion paths for your design elements, step by step. To begin, prepare your project by downloading or creating assets in SVG format. For this tutorial, we've set up an ocean scene with a fish swimming through the water. If you want a simpler starting point, just insert a basic shape like a circle or square. The same steps will apply for animating motion paths. Next, let's create a motion path. Select the element you want to animate. Here, we'll use the fish. Click the Animate button in the top toolbar, then select Motion Path and choose Draw. You can also select an existing motion path by choosing Motion Path, Select. When you choose Draw, you'll use a tool similar to the Pen tool to create a custom path, draw smooth curves or adjust individual segments as needed. Once the motion path is set, check the timeline at the bottom of the interface. Your animation will appear there automatically. Press the spacebar or click the play button to preview the motion path animation. Let's customize the motion path to make the animation more dynamic. To make the fish swim naturally, enable the rotate along the path option. Click the animation settings button on the left side of the timeline and select rotate, Auto. Want the animation to repeat endlessly? Set the repeat option to indefinite. The orientation of the fish may not appear correct depending on its original shape. To fix this, set rotate to auto reverse if necessary. This adjustment ensures that the fish aligns properly along the path. To reverse the motion direction, right-click the motion path and select Reverse. If the fish appears flipped, adjust its transform property by setting scale Y to minus 1. Once everything looks good, you can hide the motion path by setting its stroke width to 0. For more control over the motion path, you can add keyframes. Keyframes let you define movement speed at specific segments of the path. Keyframe values range from 0 to 1, representing the start and end of the motion path. Adjust these values to create variations in speed, adding more realism to the animation. Feel free to add motion path animations to other elements in your design. In this tutorial, we've added animations to additional fish in the ocean scene. When your animation is complete, preview it by pressing the spacebar or clicking the play button. Finally, export your design. Click File, Export to save your work as an SVG or MP4. And that's it! You've successfully created and animated a motion path in Xeris. Experiment with different shapes, easing settings, and effects to discover even more creative possibilities. Thanks for watching and happy animating!